Hi folks, this is Vardhan from Edureka and this video is on the top 10 reasons why you should launch Selenium. Obviously, there are numerous testing tools in the market, but today I will be telling you why Selenium is the best fit for you and why you should learn it. The number one reason why you should launch Selenium is because Selenium is an open source tool, which means anybody can use it for free. It is powered by Apache, which means any organization can use Selenium to test their website or even independent programmers can implement and practice Selenium without having to pay for it. Most of all, remember that Selenium is backed by Google, which has a huge developer community. The problem with other testing tools are that they are either licensed tools or their functionality is just not as good as Selenium. HP's QTP, IBM's RFT, Test Complete, RunnerX are all proprietary tools. And feature-wise, Selenium is a clear winner. No second thoughts. The second reason why you should launch Selenium is because there are no operating system or browser or hardware demands. You don't need a system with 16 GB RAM or a system with a lot of free hard disk space. Neither do you need to house a Windows operating system or a Mac operating system or a Linux operating system. The operating system you use for home purpose is good enough for testing with Selenium. The problem, however, with other tools is that majority of them run only on Windows operating system. With Selenium, you can also test your website or even web application on any browser, be it Chrome or Firefox or Safari or Internet Explorer or even Opera for that matter of fact. The simplicity needed to work with Selenium can be related to how easy it is to plug in USB drives into your system for transferring data. This is the next reason why you should launch Selenium. And this must be the single most important factor for any programmer to get into the automation testing domain. Most tools in the market need you to be specialized in the particular programming language. Languages such as VBScript, Java, C Sharp are among the most common scripting languages required by various tools. But with Selenium, you will not face any such restrictions. Even if you are familiar with one of the programming languages such as Java or Python or Perl or PHP or Ruby, C Sharp or .NET, then you can start your Selenium career right away. The next reason why you should launch Selenium is because of the availability of frameworks. Frameworks are very similar to templates. You can make slight modifications to the code as per your requirement for different conditions instead of making wholesale changes. In Selenium, there are various frameworks like data driven testing, keyword driven testing, hybrid testing, module driven testing and many more. Using these frameworks, you will reduce your time to code and time to test. And because of this, a lot of companies are adopting Selenium and looking for professionals skilled in Selenium. The next reason why you should learn Selenium is because of its strong presence in the DevOps lifecycle. Selenium forms an integral part of the continuous testing phase in the DevOps lifecycle. And today, most companies are replacing agile or waterfall approaches with the DevOps approach. Very few testing tools qualify as a DevOps tool because DevOps emphasizes on using open source tools. And also because most of the software products developed nowadays are delivered on the cloud, web-based testing tools are the ones that are extensively used. And this is where Selenium fits perfectly. The sixth reason why you should launch Selenium is because it can be easily integrated with a lot of open source tools. Some of those tools are Jenkins, TestNG, Maven, JUnit, Sikoli, and AutoIT. And when these tools are integrated with Selenium, we can achieve automation. This is where other tools lag behind. The next reason is parallel and distributed testing. Executing multiple test cases at the same time is called parallel testing and executing them in remote machines is called distributed testing. Selenium Grid is used for this purpose. By performing parallel and distributed testing, you save time to run the tests. You do not need extra machines to perform the tests and you can also execute the same test cases on different web servers. The next reason why you should launch Selenium is because Selenium does not depend on any GUI based systems. Since Selenium tests can be executed without a GUI, the tests can be carried out on web servers and automation can be achieved by scheduling the execution of test cases. And since the GUI is not involved, there will be no system overhead and the performance of your machine will drastically improve. The benefit over other tools is that most tools need a GUI for scripting and those scripts can only be executed through the GUI provided by the tool. The ninth reason why you should launch Selenium is because of the flexibility that you get while designing your test case. For designing test cases, you have the flexibility to design it either via programming logic, using WebDriver, or via the record and playback feature provided by IDE. If you are a technical person and prefer writing the programming logic, 
you can use WebDriver. If you're a non-technical person, then you can use IDE to record your tests and export that programming logic to an equivalent programming language of your choice. The last reason, but not the least important reason, is that there's an increasing demand for Selenium testers. Believe me when I say that, among all the tools in the market, Selenium has the greatest demand. And you can visibly see it on the screen, right? The one on the left shows how the Selenium job vacancies have grown since 2008. And 2018 is not going to be any different. The demand is still going to rise and even the pay is pretty good. So my advice to you is learn Selenium when it's still the right time. And on that note, I will conclude today's session. Thank you for watching the video till the very end. Happy learning from Edureka. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!